morning, everyone. We'll probably do a better intro later. Uh, but I forgot something. Are you up for a little quest, Donkey? So I have to go get it. So you gotta come with me as I see if I can get it from the bar. All right, that's more like it. Shrek and Donkey on another whirlwind adventure. Ain't no stopping us now. Woo! There's the casino. We'll go see if we can find the water bottle. The elusive water bottle that I keep forgetting. Okay, so let's see. This is where we were. I do not see it. So, may not be a thing. Maybe we have to go somewhere to find it. Maybe it's a lost and found somewhere. Okay, well, talk to you guys later. Back to our real intro. So, cannot find the wire bottle. Uh, got coffee. Um, we will be checking out the guest services to see if they have it. That's where the lost is found is. So yeah. Then off to breakfast. Intro then breakfast. Bye. So, uh, I'm scanning this camera. I got the water bottle. I'm good to go. I did have to go to guest services, so lost and found is in guest services. Hopefully it's an easily scrubbable thing. I have a white wire bottle, it was really easy to spot. Um, but yeah, got coffee, got wire bottle. Heading back to the room. Crisis averted. Okay, going the wrong way. Okay, bye for now. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to day four yes. of our Carnival Panorama Cruise. Today is our surprise sea day. Yeah, we should have been in and, Puerto Vallarta. Mm -hmm. um, but we did not make it, so we are going to have a fun-filled day of trivia. Yeah. But today we're going to do something different, and it's so exciting. Yeah. We are not going to go to Blue Iguana and have huevos rancheros. Oh, yeah. We are going to go to the main dining room and have mm -hmm. avocado toast, yeah. which is surprisingly similar to huevos rancheros. It just has a different base, mm -hmm. and... Well, I thought we would do something a little bit different because we've we've had blue iguana every morning. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna get probably if there's a burrito, I'll get that. Even though I've had the burrito the whole time. He doesn't remember what he gets off this I, menu, I but I know I'm what he gets off I'm this menu. I'm pretty sure it's pancake related. It's not. It's not. Oh, it's a sandwich. It's the sliced sandwich. Okay. It's that's, the broken egg sandwich. Yeah, it's probably it's probably gonna be that. That's what he usually gets off this menu. Or pancakes, one or two. He pancake could probably get good. both. Yeah. It's it's unlimited. That's true. Well, this one's unlimited. You don't have to charge for more. I thought this was a charge for more. You can only have one thing and then you get charged extra for more. But that's, that's not the case. Breakfast is not like that. Breakfast is all you can eat. I don't know why you're trying to upset the people. <laughs> sorry. sorry. You can definitely get a sandwich and pancakes. That's not excessive. Yeah. Anyways. Sorry, guys. So, yeah. Um, I don't know what else is we're doing today. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty um, much it. I want to go and eat sushi sometime, mm -hmm. and that might be today. Oh, there's another thing we found out. We're getting served lunches. Yes. In the main dining room. Yeah, so we're having the port day breakfast menu today, and we should have had a port day, but we're not having a port day. But so now they're giving us a lunch in the main dining room, which we've never done on Carnival. No. I looked at the menu today, and I, I wasn't. Didn't care for this one. No. Today's. No. But. Thursday. Thursdays looks good. So we're going to definitely do that on Thursday, even if we have to miss something. Yeah. Yeah. There's, you know, just only so many trivias you can do. Yeah, only so many trivias. We want to win them all, though. 
Yeah. Well, we, we, we've won several. We've won two. That's, won two. that's several. I thought it's a couple. We've won a couple. We need to win another one so that, that has a ship on a stick, mm -hmm. though. So we can both have a ship on a stick. Yeah. Well, not both of us. No, no, both of us. Oh. Okay. Anyways. What <laughs> <laughs> he's talking about. But we're going to go check in for breakfast and then we're going to head over there. So we will see you guys there. Yeah, yeah, we'll see you there. All right, let's go. Come on, let's go eat. So we are now in the uh, it's a restaurant to do our breakfast. Um, but we checked in early. We checked in five to ten minutes beforehand. I think ten minutes beforehand. And it said uh, we are, our table was ready. So we came before it opened. Do not come before it opens. They do not have the doors open. They, they do not have the doors open, so just wait until 8 when they open and then come in and you'll be able to just walk straight in and not have to be with a bunch of people in the hallway waiting for the doors to open. So it's just a little tip. Even though it says it's checked in, they will not open the restaurant until the specified time. Yeah, so we're here now though, so it's good. Alright, this is my breakfast. I got the avocado toast with a side of hash browns and a side of bacon. And then I also got some toast and I already have strawberry jam on there for dessert. And then here's what Will got. Okay, so I got short stack pancakes with an extra syrup. You only get one. Oh, and I'm supposed to have pecans too, but I don't like pecans, so they're on the side. So here I got the broken neck sandwich. Um, it comes with a hash brown, and, you get, and I got an extra hash brown with it. That's what I got. Ready to eat? Okay. Hey there. So we are at Pasta Bella. This is going to be the free lunch option that they have on Carnival. It's in Cocina de Capitana, um, but it's cost for dinner, but it's free for lunch. So you should definitely check it out. Um, this is the view out the window. And then these are the dishes that we got. So they start you off with some bread and then they um, have salad and then you can get lasagna. And then they have the make your own pasta that you saw on the menu. So you can see the two different options that Will and I got here. We really like this option. It's usually not very busy and it's pretty chill, especially on embarkation day. So if you're not in the mood for barbecue maybe check this one out okay back to hey guys so a little another PSA yeah so we just sat next to somebody in the pasta bar mm -hmm. and we were, we were eavesdropping yeah eavesdropping. but I heard her say she was gluten-free and then she asked about the straw so the candy straws they are not gluten-free yes so if you are gluten-free be careful because mm -hmm. that's like, what they'll get with most things I... yeah I wouldn't think I wouldn't think that. So yeah, just be careful. Make sure be careful with the straws. Maybe bring your own straws on board. Yeah. So that's pretty much all they have here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, learn something new today. And I'm gonna try this. So this is the tiramisu cheesecake, mm -hmm. and it was recommended to me. So I'm gonna give it a shot. In the room. Let's go. Okay. So peoples, guys, and gals. Um, these hallways are much nicer than the Ruby. <laughs> um, you were so mean to the Ruby. It's just an older ship, so I we understand. But uh, yeah, they're like you can actually fit two people down the hallway with carts. With carts. Oh, room number. That's great. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay. <gasps> so we have a little friend. We have an. Elf. And I like to, you know, slam the doors. Oh, look there. That's real door. Elefante. Elefante. Is there a view? So uh, they said we were going about 10 knots. We should get to Cabo by 6.30 tomorrow. So like a hundred miles out or something like that or not even a hundred miles something, something something like that but yeah we're in the room we're gonna try tiramisu cake we'll probably let you know a little bit later and we'll talk to you later okay we've got some new activities that we haven't been to before i think it's because we were having like perpetual sea days but we did the showdown it was a lot of fun 
this is us showing you the water and what the water looked like since it was so calm since we were going so slow and now we're gonna go do my favorite dinner come on let's go get sushi sushi okay guys we're at bonsai here's the menu that we're showing you you just select what you want and then they bring it out to you so there's some favorites that we have we always get the spicy tuna roll and we always get the shrimp tempura roll here is a salad i love the dressing on this but it's a little expensive for what it is okay so then um i don't remember which one this was that looks like the tempura this looks like the spicy tuna and then they gave us some miso soup. And then afterwards, we didn't really like the desserts there. So we went to the buffet and Will got some bread pudding. And then I got um, chocolate cake. And I, I don't remember what that other thing was, but it it was pretty good. Welcome to the love and marriage. Tonight, we're celebrating love. So if you're in love, let me hear you make some noise. Some of you are very in love. Some of you are just single like me. <laughs> if you're single, let me hear you make some noise. All of my love is with you. But tonight, I want to find out how much do you love each other? But how much do you know each other as well? So it's going to be a very interesting game. Now, this is our very own version of the Newlywed Show. I'm going to be choosing three couples from the audience to come and compete on the stage. Now, I'm not looking for ordinary people. I'm looking for extraordinary people. Now, we're looking for very specific couples. The first couple that we're looking is going to be sitting right here, and they are going to be the newly weddings. Yeah, the newly weddings right here. So, who has been together the least amount of time? Is someone in between. So, for this couple, the only thing that you have to do, if you would like to be part of this show, stand up. Stand up. Alright. Talk number two over here. Let's see what you got. Kiss it, kiss it, kiss it. together for 60 years is that correct today he said today so I'm assuming that today is your anniversary okay very good where are you from Utah Utah and over here we have Bruce and Liz and they have been together 39 years all right and where are you from Lovelace Iowa and Arizona yeah. very good and finally we have uh, Nakara yeah. and Adrienne is that correct? Very good, and you have been... You just got married four days ago, yes!